Earlier this year, Misty the dog was found abandoned and abused at the French Creek Wildlife Area near Portage. Today, her supporters put on the March for Misty, a five-block walk to the Columbia County Courthouse, where Misty's former owner faced a judge. News 3 reporter Eden Checkle has more on what was an emotional day for the event's organizers. Many are calling Misty the voice and the face of animal abuse, which is why they gathered at Riverside Park. But their journey for justice didn't end here. Misty and her foster mom, Brenda Vesley, go for a walk often. We come here to the levee to walk all three of our dogs, so she enjoys being outside. But today, there's a different reason behind their walk, one beyond their love for the outdoors. We are Misty's voice taking steps to raise awareness to animal abuse and to bring justice for Misty, a Labrador retriever who was left for dead. Misty is the face that is going to perpetuate justice for, for animals everywhere. In January, Misty was discovered by three hunters in Fort Winnebago. Her former owner, Terry Lynn Benson, allegedly beat her with a hammer, put her in a duffel bag, then left her at French Creek. Horror was my first reaction. Um, I, I don't know how anyone could come to that point where they think that that's a good resolution. Misty's story hit home for many animal lovers. It struck a nerve and, and it really pulled at people's hearts. Her supporters marched from Riverside Park to the Columbia County Courthouse. We do not seek revenge on uh, her former owner, but we do seek justice. Well, she's incredibly sad. You know, this was her dog of 16 years. Benson faces a felony for animal mistreatment. She pleaded not guilty, but a judge says there is probable cause. I don't think a felony was committed here. I think it was a misdemeanor. This is a victory not only for Misty, but for animals everywhere. And um, to, <clears throat> for the judge to say this is a felony is such a big step in making the laws change um, against animal abuse. Terry Lynn Benson is expected to go to trial sometime in the fall. In the meantime, Misty's foster mom is working on a bill that will enforce stricter penalties for people who have committed crimes against animals. In Portage, Eden Chuckle, WISC News 3.